All right, guys, before we get started with today's video, man, I want you guys to go ahead and head over to the description box, man. Make sure you guys go ahead and press that Fruit Labs link is. What Fruit Labs is, guys, is a free cop point. This is something that I use just so I am able to make these blueprint videos, guys. Be able to um, give out PSN cards, Xbox cards, uh, Google Play cards, Apple cards. It doesn't matter what it is, guys. Make sure you guys do use this, guys. Every time you sign up using my referral link, guys, you will receive 500 pips just by fully signing up, guys. So make sure you guys go ahead and take advantage of this guys because this is a, a limited time offer only all right it's your boy stunning man enjoy the gameplay i love you boys so much yo what's going on youtube it's your boy stunning welcome back to the channel if you guys are new make sure you guys go subscribe to the channel and leave a like on today's video man guys i appreciate the support make sure you guys do pay attention to the intro guys because this will give you more cop points i know you guys want to be able to buy the battle pass i know you guys want to buy these awesome blueprints that come into model warfare now the number one question that i've been seeing down in my comment section guys is how do you get that blue tracer guys how do you get that red tracer well today's video guys i decided to take the time out my day and make this video for you guys because I want to help you guys out, man. You guys been showing support to me, so I want to show support to you guys, all right? Now, let's get straight on to how to get the blue tracer. Now, the only way you can be able to get the blue uh, tracer that's in Model Warfare, you have to use the Kilo Sterling blueprint that's in Model Warfare. Now, I'm not too sure on when they will be able to bring this back because this is probably, I believe that this gun came around pretty much around like last like the two weeks ago or a week ago that's why you see a lot of videos of people make it because i heard that model warfare would not be able to bring you know these blueprints back into the game but we'll see anything can change now one thing that people um do not understand that if you guys were to take off this right here people think that having the tack laser on uh, the high power of 5mw tactical green laser improves accuracy while aiming down sights exposed position when active people seem to think that if you take this off you would not have the little blue effect tomorrow but that is not the case whatsoever you can take everything off and it would not change the gun because this when they made this gun guys this was a part of it all right now to see the blue laser part of the gun you will have to put this on now for the blue laser guys you only see the blue laser the little blue beam if you have the tech laser on the effect on the gun does not change whatsoever because that's what is a part of the gun all right i'm going to show you like a little a little like clip or whatever on how it looks like at the end or whatever now let's go ahead and go to the saraz saraz fn scar 17 uh blueprint now this is the uh the scar blueprint again this is for the assault rifles there's only two death effect weapons the one that got the little cool uh death effects where it, when i change colors every time you kill somebody with that's only the sirline and the saraz okay the kilo and the scar guys i always remember that only the scar and the uh kilo are the only two ones that have the um death effects it might change tomorrow who knows but um let's see same thing with this one now i believe this one right here this shoots out the red laser if i'm not uh misleading y'all nothing like that now for the barrel you don't have to nothing with that now same thing with this one guys again like i said before that if you take out the tech laser it does not change anything on the gun whatsoever the only thing you won't have on here guys is just the little beam that you get on there but you will have the depth effect i appreciate that's all you guys been wondering on what do you guys want to see on this so you do get the red tech laser okay you can change anything or it does not matter what you change guys you can literally change the laser on it you will still have the little red depth effect all right so yeah man I'm go ahead and show you guys a little gameplay on how both of these guns look like we're just gonna i just want to show it up not go too much in depth with it but yeah man it's your boy stun it and i'm out man i love you guys so much man peace all right, boy, yours, man. Welcome back to the channel. Now, listen, man, what I did was go into like a little bot gameplay. I want to show you guys the difference between when you take off the tracer and when the tracer is implemented on the gun. So, we're going to start off what happens when the tracer is on the gun. Let's see. We still got the little, um, the little blue line right here. All right. So, with the blue line, guys, you still got the little laser on there, if you can see right there. Uh, we got the red one right here. You, you can see it a little bit just right here. That's the red laser right there. Um, trying to look for these kids. So with the red laser, it still shoots the death effect. Okay. Now, what they are really looking for is that does this gun shoot without uh, the death effect? We're going. Uh, let me go ahead. And just kill myself right here. All right. Let's switch to without the tech laser again. I don't have tech laser on this whatsoever. So let's try to use the tech laser. Um, now with the, without the tech laser being on the gun, guys. I'm trying to make sure they don't see me. Without the tech laser being on the gun, you don't see the little blue line no more. But 
you can still shoot death effects on them, all right? Just like I said in the intro, that the attack laser doesn't it change anything whatsoever. So, let me kill this guy again. You guys see the blue effect. We're going to try the red one out in a little bit. I want to show you guys it's just accurate. So, you don't have to have the attack laser. Same thing. Still shoots blue. Still shoots bolts at the kids. Red bolts, blue bolts. Okay. You see? Red bolts, yes. See? It, it still does it, guys. Kind of. But yeah, guys, man, this is. It shows right here that you can change anything on the gun that nothing will change. So let me take everything off right here. On the kilo. Give me your quick. Alright. So I took everything off of my uh on my kilo, right? Let's see if it still shoot death effects. Yep, it do. I don't have anything on my attachments, guys. Literally, I have nothing. This is the kilo that I use right I'm using right now. I don't have nothing on it, literally. Let's try the um Try the little serling. Let me take the attachments off of this. Alright. Yes, yeah, sir. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day, by the way, man. I thank you guys for so much. Um See guys, it, it doesn't change whatsoever. You can take everything off your gun when nothing change. Literally. Nothing will change whatsoever. The gun is still the same. <laughs> it still shoots off the effect to it. So I'm pretty sure that's what you guys look for. It still does the same thing. Alright, but yeah guys, man, I just want to show you guys this out right quick. This is how it looks like. It still shoots the blue laser. We got the red laser right here. Now the red laser only goes for the, the scar, and the blue laser only goes for the kilo. Until they add more uh, death effects into the game, which they probably will. So I'm glad this is something that they implemented into the game. We will we'll probably get more of these. So you got the blue. Got the blue right here. We got the red. All right. It's your boy Stunning Man. I just want to start the tutorial on how you guys get the blue tracer and the red tracer. All right. Now I'm out, man. Game.